You won't believe what just happened. OMG. My heart's racing right now. It's 2 a.m. in the morning. And right before I was about to go to bed, something happened. My boy squad. What happened was... I'm craving for chocolate. OMG. Once again, 2 in the morning. I need to get up. I can't sleep unless I've had my chocolate and my banana. It's a mix. Guys, I'm a slave to my cravings. OMG guys, I got it. Chocolate. Mmm. Banana. Mmm. 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 What an amazing combo. Yum. Mmm. Mmm. I can sleep now. Mmm. Good morning, Mabuhai squad. Yes, here with Legaya, who is extra noisy and energetic this morning. What's up? Why are you so happy and excited? And she's excited because she's about to go outside. Time for outside and apparently a scratch. Fine, as usual. Scratch, 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 all day long. So, get this guys. My family is currently at the airport in Toronto. They're on their way here. It'll take them a day to get here. That's crazy. In like 24 hours, I'll be seeing my family all the way from Toronto, Canada, and you can meet them. Uh, hey guys, I'm excited about this. Are you telling me I need to cut my nails? Yes. I wonder what they'll think of my hair. Let's put on this harness. Come on. Guys, the merch. Flap those wings. Flap those wings. Flap those, flap those, flap those wings. <laughs> the guy's like, what are you doing? Yes, yes, I'll put it on. Here. Good girl. Tickles, right? So. One wing, yes. Then the other. By the way, this is called an aviator harness. Bought it from Amazon. Be sure to look it up at my Amazon recommended page where I list all the products I use for Ligaya there, as well as for vlogging and other stuff. There we go. Yes. Wow. Time to go outside. Step up. Oh, she wants scratches. Okay, scratches as usual. Scratches for days, forever. Spoiled, spoiled bird. Mm-hmm. Boilage never ends with this one. You guys, want a snack before we go? Since you're so bananas for bananas. <laughs> I love that she loves bananas. Yes. Good girl. I used to feed you bananas when you were just a little chick. It's one of the first solid foods you ever ate. And then for a while, she didn't like them anymore. Okay, fine. You wanna feed yourself? Go. And she dropped it. See, this is why I wanted to feed you. Birds need practice as well. They have to master their motor skills, holding food items and balancing at the same time. Yes, out here catching the rays. Mabuhai squad. Mm -hmm. The guy is loving this sun. <laughs> good for her feathers, good for our bones, skin, all of that. Woo, guys, it is hot here in Manila right now. Aren't you boiling, the guys? In case you're new to the channel, my name is Mikey Bustos. Um, this is Ligaya here, my African grey parrot. And we're here in Manila, Philippines, but I'm originally from Toronto, Canada. Grew up there, was born and raised there my entire life. And the reason why I'm here in Manila is kind of a long story, but the short, abbreviated story is one of my other YouTube channels, which is Filipino Comedy and skits and parodies, that went viral. So Manila kind of became my Hollywood. Um, and so I'm still here in my Hollywood. Um, and I'm gonna be building a house soon. So who knows how long I'll be based here. But welcome to the channel. This is my daily vlogging channel. And I cannot believe, it's blowing my mind, my family's gonna be here tomorrow. Seriously, they come and visit me every now and then. Um, I try to make it back to Toronto, back home. Um, at least once a year, but I think they're gonna appreciate the Philippines because well, it's hot here right now and in Toronto, Canada It's like it, it's been negative 20s C Celsius from what I understand. So I hope they packed some shorts 
they're gonna be boiling. Speaking of which, since my family's coming, we've got some travel vlogs coming up. I'm gonna be taking them to a couple of beaches, yes! That's why I'm prepping up all my speedos <laughs> for the trip. And um, they're also going to be going on a trip as my Christmas gift for them. They're gonna be going on a Holy Land tour. So they'll be going to uh, Israel, Jordan, and Egypt. Hopefully, I can convince my brother to vlog while he's there. Um, so they're up for quite an adventure for the next month and a half. <laughs> I can tell it's hot outside because look, all her down feathers frizz out. They like frail. It's hot out there, huh? I know. I agree. Someone's not afraid to use the ropes. I love that. I love showing you the ropes. <laughs> As a chick, I made sure to expose her to as many things as I could. Different experiences, all of that. Like, at first, like her natural instincts are to be afraid of everything. <laughs> because she is a prey animal, you know what I'm saying? It's built in her to be afraid of things. But if you socialize them at a young age and bring them out, get them traveling with you, expose them to traffic, animals, you know, different sounds, um, all of that, then as adults, they learn to become less afraid of things. But mind you, she's still afraid usually of first time anything, but she comes around pretty quick. Okay, my voice squad. Now, because my family's coming, I need to look cleaned up, you know what I'm saying? I gotta prove to them that life is okay here in the Philippines. I gotta be fresh, you know what I'm saying? So they don't worry. <laughs> they gotta know I'm doing well. So, shaving the sides and the back, obviously not touching the top. Here at Jen's Barber Shop, yes. Our friends here, they're amazing here. Mm -hmm. RJ's also cleaning up his mane. I'm also, ugh, cleaning up my gross feet. I even have like a bruise from CrossFit. So gonna get the pedicure done because especially we're going to the beach and I need to look presentable, you know what I'm saying? Thinking of even doing my nails. Guys, here's Roy. Yes, this place is the best, I always come here. RJ, are you ready? Are you ready for my family? Yeah. Do you like my family? You do? It's like strong personality. She's very Yes, that's correct. My mom was strict, super strict. The strict one. She can fight anybody. Got fired. Growing up, I used to call her the dragon. Dragon lady. But she's very kind hearted. So, RJ, when my hair is long, are you going to shave your head? Uh, <laughs> Think about it. It's gotta be shaved. Zero. Yes, my boy squad, should he shave his head? <laughs> Leave in the comments. Alright, foot spa time. Yeah, alright. Oh, this water is colder. Guys, I'd like you to meet Cindy. She's the miracle worker who will turn my feet presentable. <laughs> RJ, why aren't you getting your foot spa? I don't have available stuff in the Oh. I need it more than you do? I think you need it more than I do. <laughs> You have hobbit feet. <laughs> oh wow, they even do all the way up to the shin. See that? I guess she's exfoliating. I am so ashy. I am like the godfather of ash. Nice. <laughs> yeah, it's like a pizza. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> OMG, this is the best head massage ever in life. I'll be needing it before my family comes. Cheers. Guys, you know how the Gaia has parrot dust? And I said that humans don't produce parrot dust? I lied. Look at how dusty. I have feet dust. It's gross. <laughs> yes. Feet back restored, back to normal. <laughs> He's got strong arms. All right. Salamat po ate. <laughs> the guy uh, going bananas over her bananas. <laughs> you banana beak. You're so cute. <laughs> guys, she loves bananas. I know. Don't worry. We'll buy more bananas. All right, guys. Yes.
So back Ooh. Ooh. from the barber and you guys might realize that ooh, the picture is clearer. Why? Because brand new camera. Had to switch out the vlogging camera. The old one vlogging daily. Can you imagine the wear and tear on that? Crazy. Um, but yay! Better picture, it's clear. And better response time. Let's see how many falls this camera will survive. All right, so let's go over the checklist. Bird, nice and healthy. My place, nice and clean. Thanks to Ate Elsie. What else? Hair did, feet did. I've been doing extra CrossFit so that I can be, you know, fit and in shape. <laughs> Guys, I can't wait. I can't believe my family will be here. Tomorrow, I'll be seeing them. So guys, here's the plan. Because my place is just full of aquariums and like animals and stuff, I don't think sleeping here at my condo will be the best option. Although there, I guess there are enough like flat areas where people could sleep. Like this couch is quite large. This viewing deck here where this camera's sitting, this is also quite large. My bed is big. But instead, I think they're gonna stay for now in the other condo uh, that my mom and I own. Uh, just out of town and I've vlogged about that um, in a previous vlog. That condo is for sale by the way. Um, so they have actually two condos there that they could sleep in and it's fine. They'll be comfortable. They have their own pool. They are close to like the tourist area in case they need, you know, to go shopping and all of this. Um, and that'll be their accommodation for now. Um, my brother, I definitely want to spend more time with him. So eventually he will be staying either here or in another unit in this building which is also kind of a hotel um, on some floors so so there that's the plan and we're gonna be doing a lot of traveling so we'll be doing a lot of hotels together as well and i'm so happy that you guys mabu high squad are joining us on this family time um family's important i mean like obviously when i was living at home i was like ah oh, <laughs> The fights, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, especially with my mom. Uh, but like, as you get older and like you move out of town, you start to kind of look forward to family time. You know what I'm saying? Of course, the internet has made it a lot easier. I know my mom watches these vlogs daily, religiously, and surprisingly, my dad watches it. I have no idea when or how he watches it. Like, I didn't know he knew how to use YouTube. But yeah, he watches too. And I guess my and my brother and I are always chatting with my cousin group on WhatsApp. So we're always in touch, you know what I'm saying? But I am looking forward to them being here in the Philippines. Um, they are currently in an airplane right now. Probably like flying over, I don't know, Hawaii right now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> They're over the Pacific somewhere. Ooh, can't wait. Yes, oh my gosh. Amidst all of this craziness, I got an Ants Canada video to do. I'm in the writing stage now. Very important step in the creation of the Ants Canada videos. I mean, how do I top these past two weeks? Both videos trending around the world. <laughs> the pressures, you know what I'm saying? The pressures, I'm work. Fun pressures, by the way, not complaining. And I do love the storytelling um, aspect of running the Ants Canada channel. I love story writing. Like even as a kid, I was just writing tons of stories. Stories, stories, stories. A pad of lined paper was my dream. Like you just give me a pad of lined paper and I would write and write and write for days and days and days. I have like full novels that are left unfinished. Probably somewhere in my, my family's home in Toronto. <laughs> in the archives. Writing is life. Okay, anyways, gotta get back to work. Seriously. And little did they know that aside from the games, they were also about to fulfill a monu monumental purpose at preserving life in the entire antiverse into which they were born. Dum dum. And scene. Black screen. <gasps> Ooh, love this part. Good morning, Mabuhai Squad. Yes. 
Good morning, Ligaya. Just woke up, climbing her cage, and I'm preparing her breakfast. Guys, the Bustos family, my parents and my brother, have officially landed. They landed at 6.30 a.m. this morning at the LC and our driver, Kuya Ryan, went to go meet them at the airport and have transported them now to the condos in BGC, another part of town, as mentioned. And they're just chilling now. And they're coming here. OMG. So I gotta create breakfast for my bird. Mm -hmm. And oh man, they're probably boiling right now. I mean, considering how cold it is in Toronto. They are probably so hot. Aircon, AC on full blast. You know what I'm saying? I got corn for you, the guys. And OMG, look at what Ate Elsie put away yesterday. My heart. The blender. Oh my god. I have sentimental attachment to that blender. That blender created food for Ligaya for so long and helped her wean. Oh, Maybe one day she'll want like a parrot smoothie, which apparently parrots can have. Okay, okay, Ligaya, making your breakfast. You remind me of me when I was a kid, when mommy's making breakfast and I was like demanding for it. Not knowing how hard it is. The effort it takes to be a parent. Guys, my mom used to cook amazing meals. Like, truly amazing meals. My mom is like top chef. Now, I'm not saying that just because she's my mom. But like, even my aunts and uncles know my mom can cook. My dad too. Both of them can cook. Both my parents were good cooks. Me, I know nothing. I can chop vegetables. I can cook eggs sometimes. Guys, leave in the comments suggestions as to what you guys would like to see us do, I guess, as a family. Like cook. Maybe my mom can give her secret recipes. Let us know what you guys want in the comments. Guys, I am so proud of Lagaya right now. She is literally trying every single item I've put in the bowl. She's eating red bell peppers right now. Earlier, she picked up um, a carrot, <laughs> she had a taste of um, broccoli, but right now it seems like her staple is banana. So proud of you, the guys. Very, very good. Mm-hmm. Omji! Omji! My family's on their way here. <gasps> okay, we're gonna go have brunch. <gasps> I need coffee. I'm gonna need all the energy I can get. Mm-hmm. Oh, yes, the guys. Gonna be something. Oh, OMG. Okay, how do I look, guys? The Gaia, be right back. At the LC's on her way up. Mm hmm. Let's do this. Alright, here we go. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. 